go. <laughs> All right. <laughs> yep, and here we are with part four of Sonic Colors DS. And today I have yet another guest uh, with me. Oh, no, so I'm the Sonic 49. Anyway, uh, honored guest, please introduce yourself. Hey, everybody, what's going on? This is Super Sonic X Zero here. What's what's up? Um, is it all right, is it all right if I say your name too? Uh, I find it easier to, to say. Mm hmm. Yeah. Uh, he's also called uh, um, uh, Dominic. Uh, it's a much more simpler name for me to uh, say. No, but anyway, we're in Planet Wisp right now. It is a four stage. Well, I, I mean, most of the stages and colors you can actually tackle in the order that you want, but. Technically, Planet Wisp would be the uh, Force Sage. Hmm. Interesting. <laughs> no, but um, what, what's what's your experience overall with, with uh, Sonic uh, Colors, uh, either the Wii or the DS version? Um, the Wii version was actually pretty fun. I definitely, I do, I definitely like it. I mean, I, I think I, I, um, uh, I really like the music in the game. I mean, it's awesome. It, it, it had a it had a, a um its variety of music is really good too. You have you have jazz, rock, uh, huh. Well, like uh, also a uh, very peaceful music too, which is uh, what Planet Wisp uh, mostly has. Mhm. Mm no, oh, but anyway. Oh, I'm, that was I'm... my favorite one. That was my favorite. Um, Planet uh, Planet Wisp has one of my favorite songs. <laughs> yeah, although in the. Uh... The only issue I have with, uh, no, I mean not that we're not talking music here, but let's let's talk level design really quick, being that we're in the tutorial. Yep. Um, my only issue with the DS version of Planet Wisp is that it's really, really, really heavy with the Drill Wisp. Oh yeah. Yeah, there's a it it gets used a bit frequently, which uh, it's not a it's not a humongous gi like giant issue, but uh, I really enjoy the music of Planet Wisp, so. Uh, but I enjoy the Drill Wisp music as well, but when it interrupts Planet Wisp uh, so many times, I'm just like... Can I get out of the Drill Wisp now? Oh, yeah. Mm-hmm. I like that. I like the music with the Drill, too. Oh, yeah, and uh, you probably already saw the little cutscene with Sonic uh, getting that Wisp power. Uh, that happens with every Sage, though. With Aquarium Park, it's a little different. It happens... It literally happens off-screen, sort of. When really? Hmm. Huh. Yeah, Sonic Sonic actually chases after the uh, laser wisp, which is the wisp you get in the uh, aquarium in the aquarium park. Hmm. Cool. No, but anyway, um, the, uh, the now the level design of the game so far, being that I'm up, being that we're up to sorry, someone yelled, being that we're up to aquarium park, uh, I've actually really liked the level design of colors uh, DS, and I've already replayed. Rush and Rush Adventure, which I did record for this channel, and I gotta say, I'm actually really, uh, I've had a very pleasant time. That I think there's there might have been one cheap little part, and it's actually <laughs> it's actually in this stage, but we won't see that yet. I mean, uh, other than that, I think the level design has been pretty nice, except for Planet was with the overuse of the uh, drill. Yeah, I know the I, I see the rocket like right now. I. Well, I really, I really don't have anything else to say about the rocket. Although it has a pretty nice music to it, pretty it's, nice ring. It's, it's very short, though. I know. No, but um, well, no. Being that you're, uh, have you played the DS version before? Uh, if not, what do you think of it so so far? Or I'm not sure if you watched the other parts uh, to this. I might have watched um, maybe one part, maybe about a while ago. Maybe I've. It kind of reminds me a lot of a. It kind of reminds me a lot of Sonic Rush, and I, I kind of, I, I kind of like Sonic Rush. Although I never got, I never got around to the first. I never got around to the first game, and it's just, you know, I try to pick a, I try to pick the right time to like play it, but I was so busy recording other stuff on my channel, so. <laughs> yeah, I mean, the, 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 this is. It basically is the third Rush game. The. So, the, all, the only thing it doesn't have, uh, which I mentioned a few times, is the uh, trick system. You you get uh, boost energy from enemies and from uh, from white wisp capsules. Other than that, uh, you actually have to. Th there will be plenty of a few times where you won't have any boost energy, so it's actually very wise to conserve that energy. Oh, uh, they got uh, they got rid of that. Uh. 
Yeah, yeah, no, uh, um, I know. I miss the trick system too, but uh, I don't. I don't mind this as well. It, 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 if anything, it keeps the pace going. Mm -hmm. Though when you maxed out the uh, boost meter in Russian Rush Adventure, it was, it for a few seconds, it was uh, infinite. I see. Uh, here though, it's it's not like that, but it's not not a big deal either. My the only other minor complaint that I have is uh, the <laughs> the drill whist. I know I, 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 that part was a little funny. Um, the only other minor complaint I have is the controls for the drill whist. Um, they're not bad or anything, but they're a bit stiff. Like they're a bit, they're like, a bit stiff. I mean, uh, think of it like a, a truck with a tractor trailer. It takes it takes a few seconds to like really get a uh, a proper turn where, wherever you're going. Uh, like a tractor trailer, it's the same thing here. It feels like it takes because you make it like an arc before you actually turn. You don't just turn right away. So when you're turning, just j just remember that you're going at a bit of a curve, just like a truck. Oh, I see. Yeah, just like a truck and a tractor trailer. Uh, same thing applies here. You you gotta make sure you turn just a like a second, like a split second before you actually turn if you really want to turn properly. Which, uh, as you can see, I was I'm not doing or wasn't doing, so I kept bumping into everything. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and that is Act One. Although we didn't, I didn't get enough rings to enter the special stage, so we'll probably see that. Uh, we'll, we'll actually see the special stage at the end of the video because I didn't get all, enough rings in Act Two either because I died. <laughs> I died. Uh, you're you're gonna love what kills me. And uh, all all it did was was remind me of one section of Mega Man X6. Oh. Or I should say Mega Man Seven and Mega Man X6. Oh yeah, uh, one other thing that uh, I actually did not mention as much. Uh, every stage you go to has uh, two two extra missions, and each and, and F for all those two extra missions, there is a different uh, random Sonic character. For this, oh god, that's a lot of noise. For this stage, it's uh, Charmy B and uh, Espio. Mhm. Mm anyway, I'm not accepting Charmy's mission because I simply don't want to. Espio, though, when we see him, we'll definitely help him out because he's a bro. I'm surprised they didn't put. I'm surprised they didn't put. You know, Rouge and Knuckles in the Wii one. I wonder why. I yeah. Uh, th this. Uh, it's funny. This game is. Uh, does the opposite of its uh, con con console uh, counterpart. Mm -hmm. Um, including. Uh, we 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 were talking to. I was talking to Phil the other day. I'm like, hey Phil, you want to? Uh, unlike the Wii version, there's a Super Sonic final boss. You want to know what it is? And our other friend was. Oh my god. Uh, and, uh, crap, I lost my train of thought. Oh, okay, no, uh, f um, our friend Vic said, uh, mother, mommy, mommy, and then, f and then Phil said, uh, the answer to what the final boss was, and I was like, oh my god, he actually got it. Uh, yeah, wait until you see the, wait until you see the final boss for this game, it's, uh, weird. Oh, okay. <laughs> Yeah, basically the the DS version brings in a bunch of random characters, but they're only in missions. They, they they don't really do much else. But it's like this: the DS version adds a bunch of things, but it does not contradict the Wii version. It's the same as the Wii version, just with a bunch with a bunch a couple of extra little details that does not contradict the uh, Wii version in any way. Oh, interesting. So yeah, that's basically how the DS version is. You know, besides it being side scrolling and whatnot. You know, I was kind of expect. You know, on the Wii version, I was kind of expecting. You know, like super, you know, Super Sonic to show up on the final, on the final boss scene, and you know, I was expecting it, and nope. I was like, when I, <laughs> and it's like, you know, when I finally beat the game, and I was like, wait, a and you know, when I finally beat the game, I was like, wait a minute, what happened to Super? So what happened to Super Sonic? And it turns out that you know, I have to beat the whole. I have to beat a lot of stages in order to get Super Sonic, and I was like, that was messed up. Well, actually, you had to get every red ring in the Wii version to unlock uh, Super well, Sonic. Well, red ring. That's what it was. Three, two, one, go. All right. Anyway. After after that seven and a half hour wait, because I had I had le jobs. <laughs> le jobs, that's funny. Yeah, I had. Yeah, uh, I also smell like a. Uh, I I also smelled like dishwater, and I had to take care of that. But anyway, we are back, and we're still in uh, Planet List. We're still in Act One, aren't we? Yeah, we're in Act One. Yep. No, or, or no, no, no. Wait, we're in Act Two. Are we? 
I forgot. I, think, I don't know where we are. I think it's Act 2, I believe. Maybe. I could be wrong. No, no, no. We're in Act 2. <laughs> but anyway, uh, well, uh, what's up, everyone? We are back uh, again. We saw 49 and all the video. Oh, my God. Why did the video just do that? Uh, anyway. <laughs> the video just refreshed really quick. Did I just use the rocket list? I don't know what's going on anymore. YouTube's being YouTube's doing its things by itself. <laughs> oh, uh, oh God! This is what I was talking about—the crushing segment. Oh wow! Yeah, of course. When we get back, it's at the crushing segment. Why wouldn't it be? Death. Yeah, I, don't, I know. I don't like that crushing segment. <laughs> it's uh, it, 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 the main problem with it is the the drill was stiff turning. Like I like I want to grab something, but I'm just like trying to turn. Then it's like oh, man, oh all fidgety. God. That scares me. That really does. Yeah, and f right after that, you just head straight down and boom, go. And I think we're done with Act Two, actually. <sighs> okay, that that was a great part to get back to. Oh, uh, <laughs> that announcer, he said, "Good, C rank." So, and Sonic's very sad-looking face. Made him sad, man. I made him sad. I failed him. Oh, uh, you tried. Hey, just give me a sticker. You tried well. Anyway, hi, Espio. But yeah, um, like I was saying before, two random Sonic characters per stage. I think Cream the Rabbit was in uh, the first stage, but uh, I actually didn't do either mission in the uh, very first stage, which is a uh, tropical resort. Anyway, Espio's a very mean person. You want to know why? You want to know? Want to know where his mission takes place? What? I'll give you one guess. One simple guess. At the crushing segment. Yeah, I see that. What a troll! I, I, th this thing cost me my, my rings, and he sends me back here. He he knew. He knew. Dude, ninjas. Ninjas, man. Freaking ninjas. I like ninjas, but... I like Espio, I like ninjas, but... Training is discipline. Some things are invisible to the... Ah, oh, darn you. Uh, okay. <laughs> yeah, I... I'm feeling... I'm feeling very emotionally confused right now. I'm oh, emotional. how come? Because Espio lied to me. And then we, we have this boss who I don't... Oh, I forgot the name of... I forgot the names of all the bosses in this game. Oh, huh, that bus looked way different than what I remembered in the Wii one. <laughs> yeah, um, it's a, it's the same, sort of the same situation where all the bosses are, like, the first zone and fourth zone are the same, second zone, fifth zone are the same, third zone, sixth zone are the same. Except the, the DS version, uh, there are, there are actually a bunch of differences between the, uh, bosses. This one, you can actually damage it underwater. But, um, you know, in the, in the, uh, Wii version, it's... I died. The Wii version. <laughs> <laughs> the Wii version. It's uh, it's basically the same boss, except you can use the pink wisp, which lets you spin dash. And the Wii version. Yeah, the 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 the, the random decisions on how wisp worked in the Wii version was uh, odd. Mm hmm. You know, pink pink lets you spin dash. Green lets Let's you hover and light dash. Uh, uh, use the uh, light speed dash on rings. But yeah, I hit one of the orbs, and now the boss, the boss's health meter, goes resets. Um, but here's the thing: if you hit the two orbs underwater again, he'll actually immediate fall immediately to the ground. So hmm. basically, so basically, uh, it's it's the closest thing he has to a, a, a major uh, weak spot. Interesting. Oh yeah, another thing. When you jump into a boss regularly, it does uh, it just does normal damage. But if you boost into a boss, you grab a wisp from them. As you can see, the, as you can probably obviously see, this guy has a drill arm, so boom, drill wisp. <laughs> anyway, go right back underwater. Let's try to get these again. And uh, I really do, I really do like the drill wisp, but it's kind of it's finicky. So because this boss slightly annoyed me, I'm gonna finish it off with my face. The best way to finish any boss in this game is with your face. I see. <laughs> <sighs> anyway, 
Uh, I think, th I do believe there's some cutscene now. Let's just discuss this. You did it, Sonic! That was over fast. Yo, guy, why don't you, Sonic? Oh, it was nothing. Maybe now they, they can yeah, count on me to blink. Huh? They sound upset. They keep saying, he's not here. He's not here. Maybe Eggman's goons got... Ugh. Jesus. I, I go too fast. I'm too yeah. fast. Okay, let's go, Tails. <laughs> oh, Sonic... Oh, yeah, no, I mean, you'll, you'll see it later when I upload the next part to this. But, uh, Sonic accidentally insults one of the, uh, Wisp. And, and Tails almost translated, but it almost translates, yeah, translates it to them. But Tails is like, no, I actually didn't translate it to them, so don't worry. So he, he was about to piss off the Wisp. Mm. I can only imagine how well that would have gone. Because especially we're saving them, and then Sonic's about to go in and, and insult them. I know, right? It's just... I that one wish that always has that little mad face. It's just like I'm beginning to think that I'm beginning to think that Wisp hates Sonic for some reason. No, I mean I wouldn't say hate. They just have strong feelings. Uh huh, strong feelings. But at the same time, that thing is like fast. Oh, um, wait. When you see the uh, conversation with the uh, laser wisp later, I think you'll like that one a bit as well. Anyway, um, the cut the uh, cut scenes here. Blah. The special stages here, as uh, we've discussed a few times with other people, uh, half pipe like Sonic Rush, Sonic 2, Sonic 4 Episode 2. Um, this this one can be a little uh, not bleh, not meh, but uh, you just gotta be careful. You um, like uh, have you seen the uh, the videos the uh, the other ones or if you want I'll explain it again. I don't care. I might have seen the videos with this one. Yeah, basically, just get the orbs that are the same color as the, uh, well, as the screen, as your uh, top screen. If not, you're going to mess yourself up the next round when you have fewer orbs to collect. Mm-hmm. That, that's basically the name of the game. Uh, and uh, things get faster and faster and faster on its own. I definitely remember the Sonic Heroes special stage, man. That was awesome. Uh, uh, so, I so, couldn't... Oh, yeah, uh... Um, I actually agreed, despite the uh, controls being really, 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 really slippery. I had the game. I had the GameCube one. Um, I, I did as well. Um, I actually bought Phil the Xbox version just in case we were gonna play through that. But as uh, some people saw, have already seen in our little discussion, we are gonna attempt to do the PC version, either that or use the GameCube version in Dolphin and try to edit some sound files with I the. I love going. I, do, I really love going fast on the bonus stages <laughs> in Sonic Heroes. It's just. Oh wait, um, I do I do too. But do you know that there's a little trick to basically cheat the uh, boost meter in the special stages of Sonic Heroes? Yeah, basically, it's it's basically like this: fill up your boost meter a bit, switch to tails or no. Uh oh. But as I was saying... Yeah, before before Skype just rage-quitted on either you or me or both, like I said, you're, use uh, use Tails or Knuckles, boost as them, but while you're boosting, boosting, switch to Sonic, and your boost meter will still be consumed, will be consuming the same way, because Sonic consumes it the most, Tails and Knuckles consume it the least. So I know, you, I know you, you have to switch in Sonic Heroes. That's what I like about that game. It's like, oh, switch. And it's like, oh, go back to switching to go back to switching to Sonic because you know you need to you know get to the, you need it's like you need to get the Chaos Emerald before the times run out. <laughs> but no, um, the the way every the way everything is in uh, is in that game when you just uh, uh, my mind is messed up because this because everything keeps going wrong. I know <laughs> nothing's working. You know, like <laughs> I'm trying to get my friend here, my friend. And then everything just crashes. It's not I fair. know. But anyway, yeah. <laughs> just lose this tails with knuckles and switch. And keep... Don't let go of the boost button. <laughs> That's it. <laughs> if, if, this crash, if this crashes again, I'm going, I'm going to punch my cup of milk. It's the, it's the only thing I, th I can think of punching that that will only spill but not hurt anything else. I know, right? <sighs> but anyway, <laughs> a any closing thoughts? Um, I I I really love Sonic Colors. 
<laughs> but uh, what do you think? Uh, I mean, you only you mostly saw Planet Wisp uh, on the DS version, but uh, what do you think of it? Yeah, I can see that you. I can see that you had a lot of trouble with it, um, especially with the crushing segment. Uh, mostly that. I and the part where it died on the boss, but uh, <laughs> I mean, well, well. Well, uh, well, I'll tackle that again somehow and not die and just... Well, we'll, we'll cross that bridge again later, basically. Mm-hmm. Literally. No, but anyway, uh, I really appreciate the, the help, Dominic. Uh, uh, any, anything else you want to say to the wonderful audience that may, or, that, that may want to say... Uh, may, that may want to hear your thoughts. All I have to say is, you know, it was. It, I really had fun with this. I hope you guys really enjoyed the video. Uh, come check out my channel. I'm pretty fun. Yeah. Um. Uh, I'll leave the link to your channel in the, in the description. Um, um. It would be very uh rude of me to not do that. Uh. But uh. uh D Silent. Lo uh. D oh, God damn it. D Silent Nine. I mean D Silent Forty Nine. Let me know if you want me to do any more projects with you. I would be happy to. Uh, I, I would be more than happy to have you on board again. It was really fun doing this, despite the mishaps that happened twice. With the, with the, um, you know, canceling out. But, yeah, um, everyone, I'm the Sonic 49, and, uh, I, I, I why, why am I forgetting your username on YouTube? I am, su and I am Supersonic, Supersonic X0. Excuse me. <laughs> yeah, um, uh, I'll leave a link for his channel in the description. I hope you all enjoy this. We are signing off. Peace out.